Okay, I'm going to do just a quick unedited video here. Um, a question was brought up tonight in class. I guess it was it was like, so you have uh, a, a normal IP address. Um, it, it's a slash 24, and the first three bytes are the routing, the network portion of the address, and the last eight are the host portion. And and so you have 256 hosts, and I think everybody pretty much agrees with that. Um, I think where the confusion comes in is now we borrow a bit from the host address um, and add it to the networking address so that we can divide our host uh, area up into into smaller divisions. And it's like, how does that really work? And so you know, so you you have, you have One dot zero slash twenty four, and that means in this this zero, you have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight zeros. And when we subnet that, if we want to divide it in half, okay. So so if these were all ones, of course, this would be uh, two hundred and fifty five, and so we would have two hundred and fifty six hosts here, zero to two fifty five. So, um, but we don't want 255 hosts. We want two groups of 128. So we say that that we, so you know here. So here's the dividing line. Here's the network side, and here's the host side, right of the of the IP address, and it, it divides right on this on this here. And so there's 24 bits here, and then um, over here there's eight bits. And so we want to extend this over one more bit. And this would then give us 25 bits. And so if we take this, uh, we're just going to extend this dot here. So we're going to be dealing with the last octet. And so what we've said is that we're stealing this bit right here, but we're still keeping these. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And as you know, it's one, two, four, eight, sixteen. 32, 64, and if you add all those up, you get 128. Or we can just double 64 and get 128. So here's what happens. Um, this is part of the networking address, but this is determining also which half, because normally you'd have 256 addresses here. This bit is determining whether we are going to send the addresses to the low group, 0 to 63, uh, or the high group 64 to 128, or um, I'm sorry, 0 to uh, uh, 127, or the high group 128 to 256. So if this is a 0 and these are all 1s, is that what I want to do? Um, okay, if this is a 0 and these are all zeros then this number would be zero. And if this is a zero and these are all ones, because we're only allowed to, to, to address hosts in the host portion now, because this is, the, this is the now the network portion, we add this up and this comes up to um, 128. So, but since we started at zero, this is actually 127. But we can have a total of 128 addresses there. So now we take this this borrowed bit and we change it to a one, and we follow it by all zeros. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oops, I had one too many zeros there. So seven zeros and a one. This is the 128 portion of the of the. Uh, uh, of the eight bits, right? So then this address starts at 128 and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah. So and then this goes to 255. And so by by taking this bit that this bit that we borrowed going from 24 bits in the, in the network side to 25 bits. And we are using that then to decide whether we want the low half or the high half. And of course, if we go 26 bits, we're going to steal two bits. 
And in binary, if you've got two bits, you can have either all zeros, 0, 1, 1, 0, or 1, 1. And this gives us four addresses. Actually, four ad address ranges. And we've essentially then divided that, that uh, slash 24 into um, equal, equal groups of uh, 64. So hopefully that makes just a little more sense. We'll hit this again in class uh, for if, if you have questions on this um, on Thursday. All right, thanks.